Good morning, everybody. I am back with a vlog. I know I look rough. Sorry about this angle. It's the only one I can get that's semi-decent with this phone mount that I have. Um, we just got a new car, so the, um, the vents are different in here, and I just have a phone, um, like, a, I just have, like, a vent mount, if that makes sense. So, um, so this is, like, all the way off to the one side, so I'm sorry if it's a little weird, but <clears throat> I'll fix it, or I'll figure it out eventually. Right now, I am going to not my doctor's office but the lab sorry if it's a little shaky our road's like super bumpy because of the because of the gravel that they put in um it, they, they put like a crush gravel type thing so that we can um I don't know so that it's like more compacted down instead of doing asphalt for some reason so whatever but I'm going to um the building that my doctor's office is in to get lab work done and um and that's about it and i'm not sure what else i'm gonna do after um it just depends on how the kids are doing words hasn't been feeling the best so it just depends on how they're doing and what time i get done because it might take a while all right so i'm sorry about the lighting it's early so the sun's rising whatever my hair is crazy i cannot tame these baby hairs i don't know what's going on with them today but they just won't stay down so whatever but um I figured I would just why would this not turn down all the way anyway so I figured I would just give like a mini pregnancy update while I'm driving so I am 10 weeks yeah I'm about 10 weeks pregnant today and I am well I was extremely sick like from the first day that the morning sickness hit me I was throwing up like 20, 15, 20 times a day. I couldn't keep anything down. I had such a horrible migraine from um, being so sick and from throwing up so much that I was just totally miserable. And after a few days of that, I called my doctor and I asked for a prescription um, just to help me out because it's just, it was so difficult to, um, to Jesus, the sun. I don't know where my sunglasses are either. Um, but anyway, it was just so difficult to take care of two toddlers that want a lot of your attention and when you play with them and everything when you're so sick and you feel horrible. Like, my, I mean, migraines alone are really bad. I've had them my whole life. But migraines on top of throwing up over and over and over again and not even be, being able to keep down a single sip of water was just horrendous. So I call my doctor, um, I'm on deglesis, is that how you say it? I'm on deglesis now, and I feel a lot better. I'm sorry if you can hear the air vent. Um, the kids have like a se separate heating and air conditioning system in the back, and I would just like them to be warm. <laughs> but anyway, I'm on deglesis now, and after like a day or two of taking it, it kicked in and it helped a ton. I still don't have the best appetite, but I don't, like, I haven't thrown up, oh, sorry, I've thrown up, like, one time since I started taking that, like, two weeks ago. So, I'm happy about that, um, because I really, I want to stay active, and I didn't really go to the gym at all last week because we were all sick, or, well, we weren't, like, sick sick, but I had, um, a little bit of a sinus infection, and it's hard to work out when your sinuses hurt really bad. <laughs> So, um, I started back at the gym this week. I'm try I'm just going to do, um, about three days a week because I, I've noticed that with this pregnancy, I'm getting really sore for a couple days after I work out, no matter what I do. Like, I don't go do anything super crazy. Um, like on Monday I did legs and my legs are still extremely sore and I haven't been sore since I started like working out regularly so it's just it's hard but um but yeah so I'm just trying to take it a little bit easier until I have a little bit more energy in the second trimester um to get back to my normal workout routine 
so that is pretty much it. Um, I am extremely bloated. I've already had to break out the maternity pants. I I don't have anything else really to update. I love when people get over in the other lane like after after the um was it the merge lane is over. Like they'll get over in the other lane afterwards. What's the point? What was the point of getting over? Because you didn't get over when it would have been helpful to the person trying to merge. But anyway, so yeah, that's pretty much it. Uh, I'm starting to show a little bit. I'm feeling a lot better. And yeah, I'm just really tired pretty much all the time now. Which makes it really hard to find the motivation to do anything at all. Alright guys, I just got my blood drawn. That was super annoying. The lady kept saying that I needed paperwork that my doctor never gave me. And I went up to my doctor's office. Like I toted both kids up to my doctor's office like two floors and half a building away and they and they were like oh no there's no paperwork that needs that you need to have to get this done sorry about this angle once again these vents are weird but yeah they were like there's no paperwork that you need to have done for this um it's just blood work all they have your information in the system they need everything. Sorry, they have everything that they need. So I was like, okay, cool. Well, apparently not. Apparently they were just like, oh, well, there's all this blood work. Or not blood work. There's all this stuff that has to be done for pregnancy. And blah, blah, blah. And I was just like, okay, well, can you call them? Because I just went up there. After you sent me away the first time, I just went up there and asked them. They said that there was nothing. And they were just like, okay. And just did it. And I was just like, what the? What was the point in, like, arguing with someone who, like, I don't know what y'all need. And my doctor's office said that there was nothing that they needed. Clearly, they were fairly close together because that's the only, that's the lab, only lab in the building. And that's the only place you can get your blood drawn there. So, I don't know. I don't understand. But, whatever. So, I got my blood drawn. Oh, gosh, I... It burns really bad, like where the site that she drew my blood from hurts so bad. I don't know why, it sucks. But yeah, I don't know. I'll see you guys in a little while. Hey guys, um, I don't really know what's going on with this lighting. It's a little dingy. Sorry for the mess in the back. I'm holding a wet paper towel because I'm waiting for it to finish eating. It's about 3... 3.45. The kids, neither of the kids have um, really been feeling the best. I think that both their ears are bothering them. And um, I did get changed, by the way. <laughs> That's why I look different. Um, but their ears have been bothering them. Sorry for Jamie screeching. So they both took pretty long naps. And I mean, I just let them sleep just because usually that helps them when they, um, when they don't feel good. It helps them to sleep a little bit more. And they're not as, they're not in as bad of moods. So they just ate lunch. I mean, they ate before they went down, but it wasn't, I wouldn't say it was like a full meal. So they ate lunch. I guess it was literally just like an uncrustable. That's all that they wanted. That's all that they ate out of all the food that I gave them. Yeah. Yeah, so, um, so they just ate. We're waiting for Tristan to get home and then he has to go back to the car dealership. Um, so we just bought our new car and apparently there was something else that they need him to sign that they forgot so we have to go back there but i love this car it's such a mom car it's a minivan but whatever I okay so i have an angle a certain way just because i just don't want my license plate to be showing but we got a 2020 toyota sienna it is so nice um i love it <laughs> um it's just the le but yeah, I mean, that's pretty much all there is to say. We looked at it a bunch, and the- Ow! Jeez, Jamie just smacked me with the car door- with the door. But anyway, um, we looked at a bunch of different minivans, and the Sienna- or sorry, the Toyota seemed to have the best, like, base features, so that you didn't have to buy the most expensive model to get, like, any features at all. Even the Chrysler Pacifica didn't even have, um, electric doors. 
uh, with the ones we were looking at if you looked at the base model. So we didn't want anything fancy because kids tear stuff apart and <laughs> and yeah, so we got a 2020. I'm really in love with it. It's really nice and yeah. So with that, we just got, sorry if I was looking off to the side, we just got, um, what is it, just cloth seats. We bought the protection plan so they put um, like a scotch guard type thing on the top of it. And they do that on, they do something similar, not obviously not scotch guard, but they do something similar on the whole outside of the car, like the paint on the outside. So we're taking it in to get that done next week. I think it's Tuesday. I think it's next Tuesday. It's the 10th, I believe. So we're having that done. Um, and then along with that, I think they said it was like within the first 10 years of us having it. If there's a stain that we can't get out and they can't get out, then um, then they have to reupholster whatever it is. So that's really nice. As well. Hey guys, so I'm sorry about the lighting. It's sort of crappy. We're sitting at the car dealership right now. We're waiting for, I'm so shiny. We're waiting for Tristan to get out of the dealership. He had to sign something. Um, something that they needed him to sign still, even though we bought the car on Saturday. So, I don't know if you see Rose back there, who waved her little arm around her little foot. But anyway, so we're just waiting for him to get done, and then we are going to go out to dinner, I believe. I think we're just going to stop at this pizza place nearby. We're going to go to this place that's like a soul food, like southern type of restaurant, but... um. But I checked the wait and it said that it was really long. Like it said there was like an hour and a half wait and I'm not about to wait that long at 5.45 with two toddlers. <laughs> and we're an hour away from home too. So um, I think we're just gonna go to this pizza place. But yeah, so that's what I'm doing right now. I'm hoping that he comes out sometime soon because he's been in there for like 40 minutes. So hopefully he comes out sometime soon and we can go eat because I am hungry. <laughs> the face. <laughs> <laughs> He's gonna do the other one. He said these crowns taste good. Hey, Your hair's looking a little rough. What are you coloring? What are you coloring? You don't know? Hey, everybody. Sorry. I'm sorry I look sort of rough. I just got up. It's pretty early right now. I look, quick, sorry, my lips look really washed out because I just put this like medicated balm stuff that I have. That's sort of like a white color. So that's why they look really washed out. But that usually fades after like 20 minutes. But anyway, I forgot to end last night's vlog. We didn't get home until sort of late. And we put the kids right to bed and honestly I just went right to bed after them because I did not feel good and I just wanted to go to sleep. So yeah, that's all for today's vlog. I know we didn't do a ton. I'm going to be starting tomorrow's vlog right after I finish filming this outro. And yeah, so I hope you guys enjoyed and I'll see you guys next time. Bye!